Good evening, everyone. Bonsoir, tout le monde. As the picture indicates, that's me. I'm Caroline Polsack. Who's Caroline? Uh, well, I'm here to represent the Montreal Canada Day Parade, and I'm very happy to be here. But uh, a bit of my background, though, I'm a nurse in charge for over 35 years full time, uh, closer to 40 years, and. Uh, assistant head nurse, most specifically, but anyway, I've been with Canada Day Parade for many, many years. I met uh, Dr. Singh. <laughs> this man is 80 years old today. That, that's a picture from last year. It's a very recent picture. So anyway, so Dr. Singh is a Trinidad, uh, Trinidadian-born man, a Montreal cardiologist. So he was a doctor, I was a nurse for over 18 years and he kept talking, come to the parade, come to the parade, so I did. At the end I'm driving his car for five years, but for the past 10 years I'm secretary to the parade and also one of the directors. We're three directors, myself, Nick Cowan, and uh, Nick Cowan's the president, and uh, Leo Fauvel. Um, I've been asked to speak about multiculturalism a little bit because if anybody's multicultural, it's myself personally and the parade. Uh, my background, my dad uh, was Hungarian. My mother was born in Romania but didn't speak Romanian. Lived there five years when there was German and Austrian. So I'm a product of the Hungarian-Austrian uh, union. Uh, that's what was going on in Europe many years ago. So my first language was German. But uh, with the Canada Day Parade, there is multiculturalism and our mission um, is to serve Canada by giving all Canadians a chance in unison to celebrate Canada's birthday. Uh, we try to keep politics out as much as possible because it is a birthday celebration. The groups uh, present to the world the diversity and the beauty in our cultures and in ourselves. All the group participants have two personal characteristics in common, I find. They're all a very appreciative and thankful type of people, and they're all passionate about their culture. And they have the, dec uh, the courage to decorate the world. The Montreal Canada Day Parade also portrays the Canadian value system of equality. We, we respect everyone's rights. Everyone has the right to speak their ideas. Um, another one value is respect for cultural differences. We appreciate and enjoy the various cultures, costumes, traditions of all Canadians and also freedom. There is freedom of thought, speech and of religion. We have uh, various religious groups as well. The parade grew with public participation, especially over the past four years since Nick has been there. And uh, Montreal's ethnic communities show a strong presence of Chinese. The Chinese community almost has a whole street. Filipinos <laughs> is not far behind. Then we also have Jamaican, Indian, Hungarian. They come with a double-decker bus. <laughs> We have a Scottish clan, we have Iran, we have Poland, we have Danes, we have Persians, Japanese drummers, Irish, and the Greek are coming in, as well as the Italians are returning to us. We also have French from Quebec City, Les Eclairs. It's a band and uh, they're fantastic. Uh, the parade also has um, an honorary guest every year and called the Grand Marshal. And last year we had a Mohawk native, uh, Colonel, uh, I mean Constable John D. Delormier from the Kanawaki Peacekeepers. He used to be a Grand Chief for years, I think four years, but then he went back to being a peacekeeper. So he was there with his wife and family. Uh, we also had uh, Colonel John uh, Jim Killen from the Royal Canadian Air Force representing the Snowbirds. We also had Mark Garneau three years ago. Uh, the astronaut, and uh, just like to mention the parades run by volunteers. Heritage uh, Canada does give us a small amount of money. That uh, I don't know. One of the political men asked, they don't know how the parade is run the way it is, but we are run by volunteers, myself included. Um, anyhow, we're in dire need for volunteers in the area of unit controller, which is called also a marshal 
for the groups. Ernie Pressel used to be with the parade for many, many years, over 25 years, died recently, and uh, his group left us as well, so we were left, just left. And I was lucky the Philippine community stepped in. The Chinese community was great, they took care of themselves, but the Filipinos came in to help, as well as two Greeks. And uh, if you go to our web uh, site, there's a bit of trouble going on there. Heritage Canada is in there. Someone by the name of Evelyn Reed took over. And, but our, our site is called the Montreal Canada Day Parade.com, but that's under construction at the moment. Uh, if anyone would like to volunteer with the parade, I have my cards here with me. Um, and uh, that's it. I, <laughs> I can talk more about parades, but <laughs> this is it. <laughs> Thank you.